CBS Sports presents the YouTube TV Super Bowl kickoff show. Las Vegas, its biggest show ever, about to start. Backstage with Brock Purdy and his backup Sam Darnold in the other locker room. Patrick Mahomes and the Chiefs about to take the field to defend their title. Meanwhile, Raider legends Politnikov, Plunkett, and Allen ignite the torch. It's time for everyone's unique dream to come true. And now, the end is near, and so I face the final curtain. Everybody in football has their own way. You can't help but look back when you're playing at the Super Bowl. People talked about how I didn't play the quarterback position the right Doctors way. Doctors telling me you're not going to have the opportunity to play ever again. I was starting at ground zero. It was the hardest time of my life. I remember having doubts like I wanted to quit. You know, I got drafted last as part of my story. It took a lot of love, a lot of patience, a lot of prayer. And what better stage to showcase who you are? I did it my way. This is why I love playing in the Super Bowl. It's been a hell of a journey, baby. We came here to do a job. We gotta show everybody who we really are. Yeah, go. Yes, there were times I'm sure you knew when I bit off more than I could chew. My family, I owe everything to them. It takes a village, man. Without my mom and dad, I would not be here today. My mom passed away. My sister filled that void in my life. There's so many people that have helped me get to this point. It hasn't just been a one-man show the whole way. I faced it all, and I stood tall, and did it my way. Oh gosh, I have to talk about my son to the whole world. <laughs> The world sees this big guy, and I see my baby. Every time when I say my little brother, people are like, wait, what? I didn't know he was going to be amazing like this. I really did. He didn't have any other thing in his mind besides playing football. He wanted it. When you really want something, man, you go out and you get it. You could have got drafted somewhere in the middle. At least he had a title. <laughs> he took the pen and wrote the story of his life the way that he wanted it to be instead of the way that everyone else thought that it should be. Oh, my I keep asking people to pinch me to make sure this is this is real. I'm just words can't explain how, how I feel. No, there are no words. It's so crazy, man. I love my brother with all my heart and can't imagine life without him. I'm just so incredibly proud. Sorry. Feels like a dream. It really feels like a dream. Everybody that uh, that's helped me get to this point, I get to represent them. And, uh, woo! Yes, it's a good feeling, man. It was my way.
Oil Bumps for America. Our thanks to Pete Radovich and our amazing team. As yes, it's the 49ers and the Chiefs in Las Vegas and Super Bowl 58. Hello, friends. Jim Nance, along with Tony Romo. And what a way to get this started. CBS Sports welcomes you to the following special presentation of the National Football League, Super Bowl 58. It's hard to put it in the words. Dream come true. Can't describe the feeling. This is what it's all about. This is what we play for. It's the ultimate honor. I'm a legend. It all comes down to this. An entire season has been played for the right to lift the Vince Lombardi Trophy. Super Bowl 58. Starts now! Who's going to come out of the smoke? Who's going to be hoisting that trophy in a little more than three hours' time? A trophy that will be escorted to the victory platform by a couple of NFL legends, Zonka and Elway. We're going to start with the first possession for San Francisco. I really loved the idea to kick this ball off for Kansas City. You want Purdy to have to feel the weight of this. He has, he's going to have a hard time breathing when he walks out there right now. So send him out there. Make him feel the moment. This is about Kyle Shanahan making it easy for him. Screens, little stuff, get him into the game. Ray Ray McLeod is back for the Butker boot. And now word spoken for the first time ever. As recently as maybe, I don't know, 10 years ago, no one would thought right it would ever be possible. If we'd see a Super Bowl in Las Vegas, but what a magnificent host city it has been. And now Butker and the Chiefs are ready to get us underway. And yes, the first Super Bowl in Las Vegas. Officially underway. And through the back of the end zone. And bring out Brock Purdy. At last